Welcome to a special episode of Ask the Experts. I'm Rachel Landry, and I'm joined today by my colleague, Mackenzie Mills. Hello, everyone. As some of you may know, with the release of version 23, we will be saying goodbye to the LiDAR module and hello to Global Mapper Pro. Pro will include all of the powerful LiDAR features that were included in the LiDAR module, but will also include a slew of new professional grade geospatial tools that will definitely take your workflow to the next level. Well, that's all true, Rachel, but Global Mapper Pro isn't really what this video is about. That is true. So this oopsie leads us into what we're here to talk about today, which is the new undo function, um, a function that has been asked for for a number of years. That's right. So the undo function in Global Mapper is pretty much what it sounds like. You know, many operations completed in the program will now be tracked in the open workspace so users can undo them. While the Control Z keyboard shortcut is probably the easiest way to undo a function in Global Mapper, the Undo and Redo options will also be available in the Edit menu and in the Undo Manager dialog. At the bottom of the Undo Manager dialog, users can control you know, what operations will be tracked in the workspace and available to be undone. While this looks like a short list, it actually encompasses a lot of functionality in the Global Mapper program. Also in the Undo Manager dialog are lists of recent tracked options that can be undone or redone. And once an, op once an action is undone, it immediately populates that redo list. And that's the new Global Mapper Undo function. I mean, that sounds like a very powerful yet straightforward workflow. Yes, it is. And the Undo function will be available in Global Mapper version 23 and Global Mapper Pro. Global Mapper Pro to be released in September will enhance and expand your workflow. Undo. Thank you, Mackenzie, for that very on-point demonstration of the undo function. Thank you all for joining us today for Ask the Experts. And if you're interested in learning about Global Mapper or Pro, please visit www.bloomrebelgeo.com today. And as always, be sure to stay tuned for our next episode of Ask the Experts.